Well, as you celebrate the holidays, food is often the center of the fun, whether you want it to be or not. And if you're looking for a dessert that will get a standing ovation, you can always buy it or you can prepare it. But if you decide to, decide to bake it, there are some simple ways to dress up your dessert. I mean, these are gorgeous. So joining me now, we have Shelly Taylor and also Sylvia Morrill. Come on in with nothing but cakes to help us out. You know, I'm, I'm always so impressed with your designs because the cake is the same. You know, it's got that hollow middle, which, I mean, you know, you see a bunt cake. They're delicious, but sometimes they're kind of boring. But you Ours, all don't do that. We put a flair to them, and we have lots of different flavors. Uh, the seasonal flavor for December, we have a new peppermint chocolate chip. Nice. So that's a crowd pleaser this time of the year, and hope that everybody will come try it out. We have lots of different sizes, perfect for almost any occasion, whether you're doing a gift for teachers right. or a hostess gift at a party. It's a so. nice option. Yeah, and I love these because these are the, the two bunts, enough for probably four people if you're in the <laughs> mood to share. I don't know. Sometimes that just depends. So talk a little bit about the piping on this because this is, this is interesting. This, this is more is, like a drizzle? Exactly. Okay. This is one of our options. It's the same frosting on all of our cake, but this is what we call a drizzle option. So okay. it's a little more elegant look to it. Um, very pretty for parties. That's gorgeous. How, how would you do this if you were trying to copy it? At home, if you take your frosting and you warm it up in the microwave just for maybe 10 to 12 seconds, have a squeeze bottle That's and it. you just squeeze it in layers. We have uh, alternate layers. We do three different layers, so you get mm -hmm. that nice, pretty, drizzled layer look to it. Okay. That's, it's, it's probably easier said than done, right? <laughs> but you know, in the end, what I think is cool about your cakes is that there, I mean, it's gorgeous, but it's, it's not perfect. You know what I mean? I think when we get caught up in decorating our baking, we want it to look perfect, but this is perfect. Imperfection, but perfect, right? That's right. Yeah. And then this is this is a pretty simple one. You just you can even do this with a bag, right? Yes. If you have just a, you can get at your local craft store a pastry bag and a big round tip, or what we we use a coupler. So it's just the big round hole, and you're just going to pipe it up over your cake and. You can buy a bunt pan at really any mm -hmm. retail store that sells baking pans. And you're just going to hint for that is make sure the cake is chilled before okay. you start frosting. Good point, or else you're going to so have it dripping. Then you might get a drizzle. <laughs> <laughs> Let's come around the front because what I think, you know, a lot of us do have bunt cakes and you may take it as a dessert. Um, you know, you kind of have that hollow hole, which I don't know which camera this I'm going to use. This is a signature for a bunt cake. Right. That's what it is, is the pans with the hole in the center. And the neat thing about this is at the holidays or any time of the year, really, you can even put your own decorations in if you okay. wanted to. We have people for weddings that put fresh flowers at the right. holidays. If you have any silk flowers around the house you want to add. You just kind of stick that in there. stick it right in the hole. Oh, my goodness. It goes perfectly in I mean, there. that's so simple. And what, and what are you doing? You're just icing the center and then you're piping down? Well, you pipe the outside first and uh. it kind of drapes over in the center and then you just want to smooth it out. Okay. Um, or those of you that like a lot of frosting, you could fill you the could center. Do what you want, right? <laughs> do what you want. It's very beautiful. And then I see Hanukkah, and you know, you did something with the champagne flutes as we well. We have, yes. So this is a great idea Sylvia came up with. It could be a centerpiece or place settings at your table. You have your champagne glasses all ready to toast the new year in, or just for a decorative look to your table and perfect size to put little buntinis so on. Just ideas, right? Mm -hmm. And then these you could print and make, but you guys have them. We do. We do <laughs> sell the little toppers. You can come and get those from us. We have different seasonal toppers. Um, great for the holidays, not just Christmas. We have Hanukkah. Right. Um, all, all throughout set. the year we have different ones as well. You can even get them just as Sylvia has. These are great gifts. Uh, just Hello. boxed as they are. It looks Easy very enough. Festive. A dozen bunts. So that is a great gift too. All right. Thank you ladies for coming in. Always a beautiful display. And Thanks. Nothing But Cakes is located on Beach Boulevard right there at Hodges in the plaza. We've included a link to the store's website on newsforjacks.com. You'll find it all on the morning show page. Appreciate you guys coming in. Thank